Hello guys, hope you're doing well. Back from Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Today's video is about this Lakshman C02 preamp. And I uploaded one video about this cleaning and servicing, all that. And it was pretty big, 41 or 42 minutes after recording several videos and i edited i just added all the videos so today it's gonna be same thing but i'm not going to do it i'll show you how to do it a little bit i'm not a professional uh, but i can clean these uh, audio gears once in a while and it was very rough grimy and greasy the including the front panel all the buttons volume everything except the internal part so it was covered with this the top cover unscrew one and two from sides and three from the back after that if you want to clean the pots only let me share the pots are here hope you can see okay maybe a little bit zoom in okay hope you can see the pots one another one is two here okay on the light and one is here the selector and this one is the this one is the um, phono for phono mm uh, magnet uh, moving magnet and mc moving coil uh, moving cartridge and um, this one is the selector phono line and and DAD tuner okay so this one is the volume you can see the volume part that's a in a box plastic and other options are here all these buttons all the tone controls including the selectors tape dubbing let me flip it tape in uh, tone in tape dubbing tape monitor phono straight and this one is a balance low boost subsonic filter mono tape dubbing and this one is turnover hards and they are the bass and treble okay so the for the bass and treble i showed you the pots they are pretty much accessible okay so one is here another one is here okay so what i did if you have time please check my other video about servicing of the c02 what i did i take these screws off just a second zoom out let me zoom out okay here is one two three four five six six screws on the top and underneath a few more screws are here one two three four five six so all you have to do just take these knobs off if, if i you can see just pull it off and 
the panels will come off automatically without taking them off but i need to needed to clean all these buttons see how they are shining let me zoom in it was grimy and greasy so i after taking off this front panel after taking off the screws let me uh, share another thing you have to press a little bit and push inward okay so there are two power uh, lamps one is the um, operation and this one is warm up okay so there are two lamps inside and it is in in a plastic cover okay so two of them in square shape it will you have to push it back and then that is holding the front panel all right and it will come off automatically if you uh, pull out and they will hang from this cable and also i take took this screw off to make the wires loose all right so after that all these just you can pull it off all these buttons be careful of these plastics and i used the deoxit d5 look what amazon sent me the day before yesterday it was in the box i found it yesterday with this chip you can see the chip pipe here i ordered this one this one is d5 with the beautiful nice straw or pipe but they sent me this yesterday the day before yesterday anyway so i used the the deoxy d5 on the pots to clean the pots but i used just a second deoxid f5 let me show you okay so this is the deoxid f5 this is less harder than the d5 okay i used the f5 on the balance <coughs> sorry on the balance here and also the volume because let me share a little bit also all the um, all these uh, mono subsonic uh, low boost all of these i used the f5 because let me share i'm not a tech again guys i'm not a tech but after doing this for a while and learning from others these are the plastic frames plastic boxes all of these all the buttons so instead of giving the hard one d5 i used the f5 and just um, pressed inward and outward like this to clean itself inside okay like this so i washed all of this with the dishwasher detergent liquid dishwasher washer detergent including all the buttons you can see here everything so while installing back please make sure don't break the actual buttons inside plastic so whenever you're handling this type of um, instrument uh, audio gears make sure they are fragile so make sure you are not breaking anything okay so i used the f5 as well on the volume pot let me share the volume pot here under the light see this is a plastic one so i just uninstall this part and 
I inserted the F5, deoxid F5. This is the F5 again. And rotated clockwise, anti-clockwise. Okay, also used the F5 here and here as well. The, uh, for the phono stage and for the line selection. Okay, so after washing or cleaning everything, I installed it back, including the top cover. Now the RCA ports, all these RCA ports were cleaned with the deoxid D5. Okay, and I used a RCA cable to clean them by inserting them and you can see a microfiber towel here or you can use a very thin cotton swab on with the deoxid d5 and make sure they are not you are not leaving any cotton inside okay that would be all and if you have any questions, please let me know. You can email me at pulse, P, like Peter, U-L-S-E 71 at gmail.com anytime. And please check the detail cleaning of this beautiful and powerful Lakshman preamp C02. Please check the detail um, specification about this awesome preamp all right guys that's it for today and if you have any questions please uh, give me a shout on the comment section and don't forget to keep all these screws in a safe place and remember them the sizes so one two three four four of these big and one is small from the middle of this Lakshman C02. So this is, I'm going to install it back. All right, guys, hope you liked the video and hope to see you soon. Take care, bye.